Hi everybody, it's Miss Janice from A Little Gym of Carrie, and welcome to another TLG at Home video. Today we're going to be doing family yoga together. Now yoga is an awesome way to relax as well as get back in tune with our bodies and our minds and that's what we're going to be doing tonight. Now before we get started in our yoga today, I want us to go ahead and sing the hello song together for all of our yoga friends. So you guys can go ahead and clap those hands, we can go, oh everyone please clap your hands and sing along with me. How do you do your yoga friends? How do you do? How do you do your yoga friends? How do you do? Oh, we come to gym for fun and we'll get you on the run. How do you do your yoga friends? How do you do? Boom, boom. Awesome job. I love those beautiful voices. All right, as you guys can see, I have my yoga mat behind me and I am outdoors because the weather is beautiful today and I wanted to get in tune with nature as I'm doing my yoga for the night. Now you guys can go ahead and find an open space in your house, whether it's your living room or just some open area, as well as using a yoga mat if you have one around the house. If you don't, you can use a beach towel or a larger body towel. And all of the yoga positions we're doing today are gonna to be safe to use without a yoga mat, so feel free to just do it on hardwood floor if needed. All right, I'm gonna go ahead and step back on my yoga mat and we're gonna get ready with our first yoga position. All right, the first yoga position we're gonna learn today is our downward dog. You're gonna go ahead and put your hands flat on the ground and I'm gonna push up on my toes and wag my tail up into the sky like this. And I'm gonna shake, 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 wag my tail, wag my tail, shake, shake, shake. And I'm gonna hold downward dog for 10 seconds. Hey, do any of you guys have dogs at home? What does a dog say? Can I hear your best bark? Woof, woof, bark, bark. Awesome job. And we're gonna come back down on our knees. Hey, do some dogs even stretch out their backs? <gasps> I think so. So what you're gonna do is you're gonna tuck your toes under your feet and you're gonna put your hands down on the ground and we're gonna stretch, stretch, stretch as if we're a dog stretching out our back. Stretching out our back, we're gonna say hello Scott. Hello, and then I'm gonna push back into my downward dog again. And shake, shake, shake my tail, shake, 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 and come back down on my knees. The next one we're gonna do today is our child's pose. I'm gonna go ahead and breathe up to the sky and say hello sky, and I'm going to lean forward and say hello to the earth. Say hello earth. And I'm gonna go ahead and stretch out my back and my shoulders today. Stretch, stretch, stretch. Awesome, and I'm gonna take this and add it into my upward dog. Stretch, say hello sky. And I'm gonna push back into my downward dog and shake, shake, shake my tail and come back on my knees. All right, that was awesome. Hey, do you guys think you guys can raise up one leg and try and balance in that downward dog? So we're gonna go ahead and put our hands down on the ground, push back into that downward dog, and I'm gonna take my right leg up to the sky, pointing my foot and stretch, stretch, stretch. Good balancing, you guys, keep going, keep going. You can even shake that foot up top like if you were wagging your tail, shake, shake, shake. Awesome, I'm gonna pull it through into my warrior pose today. And I'm gonna reach up to the sky, breathe in and breathe out. And I'm gonna push my arms down into a warrior pose. I know that when we think about warriors, we think about fighting and battles, but in yoga, a warrior is a very different thing. It's pretty cool. In yoga, a warrior can often be expressed through kindness. Did you guys know, as we reach up, back up to the sky that it, it takes a lot of strength to be kind to someone and being kind to someone we're gonna reach back is super powerful being kind to yourself and to other people can make you feel really good and that is an awesome quality of a warrior awesome job I'm gonna go ahead back down into my downward dog and stretch wag that tail woof woof good job all right, I'm gonna go ahead and lift up my left leg. And you can even shake, shake, shake. Shake, shake, shake. And I'm gonna pull it through into my warrior and reach up to the sky. Awesome job. You guys are gonna go ahead and twist. Beautiful. Do you guys also know that being brave and courageous is an awesome quality of our yoga warriors as well as they're reaching up to the sky it is okay 
to try and try again and become super brave. All right. I'm gonna breathe back up. Reach my hands down. And press back into that downward dog. And come down to my knees. You guys did awesome with those warrior poses and I hope you guys learned something new about what it's like to be a warrior. And we're gonna go ahead and sit on our mats. And we're gonna go ahead into our pike stretch. I'm gonna put my feet and legs straight. They're not bent, they're straight. I'm gonna push, push, push and point through my toes. I'm gonna breathe up to the sky and say good morning and good night and try and touch my toes, keeping my back super straight. We're gonna hold this for 10 seconds. Can you guys count with me? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. I'm gonna breathe back up. Awesome jobs. Hey, who can show me a straddle stretch sitting on the ground? That's right, awesome. We're gonna go ahead into our straddle stretch today. I'm gonna make a wide pizza slice with my legs. And what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go ahead and reach up to the sky one more time, and I'm gonna go and try and reach as far as I can without my knees turning in. I wanna make sure my knees, pretend they have smiley face on them, they're smiling up at the sky and saying hello to the sky. We're gonna reach up and over. Beautiful jobs. Hey, can you guys try and inch your hands out a little bit more? Beautiful. We're gonna hold it for five seconds. Five, four, three, two, one. Awesome job. Hey, can you guys walk your hands down your right leg and give your right leg a kiss on the knee? We're gonna go up and down and walk, walk, walk. And I'm gonna give my knee a little kiss. Say, Mwah. And I'm gonna go up and walk down, down, down on my left leg and go. Mwah. Can we do that one more time? I'm gonna go up and back down and sing hello knee and go up down my left leg and say hello knee. Beautiful job, you guys. You guys are doing awesome. Go ahead and shake, 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 shake it out. Awesome, hey, who can go and show me our child's pose? We're gonna go ahead and sit on our knees. We're gonna reach up to the sky and pull our bodies to the ground as if we're saying hello earth. We're gonna stretch, stretch, stretch. And this is an awesome pose to stretch out those shoulders and the back. Awesome, hey, who can go into a upward dog? Nice, you guys are awesome remembering these poses. And into downward dog. And relax. Now our last thing we're gonna do is some mindful breathing. What you're gonna do is I want you guys to go sit on your mat, you can sit on your knees, or you can sit in crisscross applesauce, whatever is most comfortable for you. And I want you to go ahead and we're gonna do three big breaths. We're gonna breathe in and bring our arms up, and then we're gonna breathe out and let them float back down as if they're butterfly wings. Are you guys ready? We're gonna go breathe in, and breathe out. Breathe in through the nose and out through the mouth and breathe in and breathe out. You guys were some beautiful mindful butterflies and I'm so glad that you guys did that little breathing exercise with me to end our yoga class today. Hey, before we go, who remembers what the two characteristics of a yoga warrior were? If you guys said bravery and kindness, that's right. Those are the two characteristics we learned about our yoga warriors today. Hey, I want you guys this week to work on being kind to your family, whether it's helping mom or dad out with some chores or playing with a brother or sister, as well as being brave and trying some new things that you might have been afraid of okay and to keep trying your best thank you guys so much for joining me for today's family yoga class and i hope you guys had fun if you guys had any fun photos to share please go ahead and share this with us on facebook and instagram we would love to see them since we can't be with you guys right now i will see you guys in our next video bye